Hi, welcome to RuneScape. Today I thought I would show you the March game pack, Lightning Weapon Overrides. And I thought we'd try them out in a dark dungeon and see how they light up and how they look in combat. The first um, set of weapons is Thunder's Edge. They look rather plain when you're wearing them, but when you pull them off, that's when the electricity starts. Let me drink some potion to protect myself. And see what they look like in combat. They look pretty cool. Next is Thunder's Great Blade, which is a two-handed sword. And when you pull it out, the lightning starts. And let's use the special attack. Looks pretty cool. Next is the Storm Strike Override, which is the bow. It looks pretty awesome. Let's see how a dragon likes it. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Last is the Storm Scepter Override, which is the magic staff. I really love the shape of it. It has a Spanish look to it. Let's see how it does. It's lightning isn't quite as obvious as the other weapons. So this is probably my least favorite one, but it is still rather a good looking staff. Let's take a quick look at these in daylight. Here we have the Thunder's Edge for either one-handed or one hand and offhand sword. Thunder's Great Blade two-handed sword, storm stroke, the bow override, and storm scepter. You can obtain these weapons by purchasing a red or green RuneScape game card and using them in March. When you enter your code, you'll automatically be taken to a page of choices of what type of item you'd like to purchase with the lightning weapons as a free item accompanying the purchase. Hope this gives you a look so you can decide if you want to get them or not. Have a great day. We shall see ya.